Okay, we're here in Northern California in the Alexander Valley. Well, where is the Alexander Valley? It's in Sonoma County between Healdsburg and Cloverdale. It's kind of an extension in many ways of the Napa Valley. In fact, Highway 29, which runs through the Napa Valley, turns into the Highway 128, which goes through Knights Valley and comes into the Alexander Valley. Alexander Valley has the Russian River running right through the middle of it. Beautiful flat plain there, very fertile soil and this is one of the world's finest wine growing regions. Some of the greatest wines in all of the world come out of here. And guess what? We're gonna take a tour today and we're gonna try a whole bunch of them. I'm gonna share with you my favorite wineries in the Alexander Valley. We've got a lot to see today. I know you'll enjoy. All right, first stop, just 400 feet off the Independence Lane exit, off the 101, is Trenta Due Winery. Now let me tell you, this is old school winery that is just absolutely fantastic. What am I talking about? I'm talking about great reds. They've got that old patch red that everybody's crazy about. They've got Cuvée 32, and they also got best of class at the San Francisco Wine Tasting Competition for their Zinfandel. It's gonna be great, I can't wait to try them. Let's get in there. Trenta Dewey is back from the main road a little bit in what feels like the very heart of the valley. The winery and tasting room are modern, but have an old world charm. Trenta Dewey specializes in red blends, and man, do they deliver great values. This is a great winery with a real kickback atmosphere. By chance, I bumped into Victor Trenta Dewey, who was kind enough to show me the impressive grounds with lots of shaded areas to sit back and relax on a warm day. And on top of that, they happened to be bottling that day and we got to see the production line in action. They also have a first class wedding and events hall with an awesome kitchen that every caterer will rave about. They even have a great barbecue pit out back. And if that isn't enough, you can also take a tractor ride around the grounds. From Trenta Dewey, it's about a five minute drive over to Alexander Valley Road and Highway 128. Along the way, you'll cross the beautiful Russian River and see some of the finest vineyards in the country. Hey, we're here at Soda Rock Winery. This is my favorite winery in the entire Alexander Valley because not only does it have great historic architecture and an amazing facility, but the wines here are simply to die for. Let's go inside and try a few. Come on. I just love this place because it really feels like time passed. All of these stone bricks are well over 100 years old. Grace and Victoria run the tasting room in the way all tasting rooms should be run, with a great, relaxing attitude. Their wines are super well balanced, with great fruit and a long finish. I'm just crazy about their red blend called Entourage. It really delivers. So good. They also have a facility big enough to handle large parties or weddings. You'll love this place and their wines. All right, next on the tour is Hannah Winery. Located in the heart of the Alexander Valley, this winery has spectacular views. Their grounds are absolutely gorgeous and their wines are spectacular. Their rosé is absolutely delicious. I mean, and, and of course their reds, all of it's great here. This is one place you don't want to miss. The tasting room is architecturally stunning and they poured a wide variety of wines for us. Their staff was helpful, friendly, and made me feel right at home. Their wines are exceptional and offer excellent value. Their cover balcony just can't be beat. It's a great place to kick back and enjoy the views and sip some delicious wine. All right, if you want to step back in time, there's one place you gotta go, and that's Fieldstone Winery. This place has got a subterranean wine tasting room. It's very old school here. It's very cool. Come on, let's take a look. The winery and tasting room were first constructed out of stones taken from the property, hence the name of the winery. This is a rustic structure with an old fashioned style tasting room. If you really want to step back in time, you've got to try their Petite Syrah. It comes from vines that are 119 years old and has a super concentrated, well-balanced flavor. The tasting room staff is extremely knowledgeable and fun with a warm, let's try another attitude. Their wines are created to awaken your senses and are all excellent values. Wow. 
Man, that almost tastes like it's got Zinfandel in there. It's such sweet, intense fruit. Going through wine after wine, I was continually wowed by the quality of their fruit and barrel aging. The long history of this winery provides lots to learn and talk about. Interestingly, this attractive property was the location for many of the Bartles and James commercials from the 1980s. Because the winery is subterranean, it's somewhat hard to see from the road, but it's not one to miss. Now, if you have the time and remember to make an appointment 24 hours in advance, there is one more winery that you just can't miss, Lancaster. All right, I've taken you about one mile off the Highway 128 to Chalk Hill Road to Lancaster Winery. Why Lancaster? Because they're super cool. They make great, super ultra high-end cabs. They also make Roth Cabernet, which you see just about anywhere. And it is absolutely fantastic too. I know you're gonna love this place. Let's take a look. This is one to impress the ladies. Their whole facility is all about class with a modern and current feel. I'm just crazy about their Roth brand Cabernet that really delivers an excellent value. Mm, I love that. Mm. The friendly staff will take you on a tour of their wine caves with ultra high-end tasting rooms. Lancaster has amazing wines and ultra modern wine caves that will impress everyone. This place is very cool to say the least. All right, that wraps up my tour of the Alexander Valley wineries. I hope you had a great time. I know I did. This is Matt with Thumbs Up Wine. We'll see you next time.